Well, apparently Boris has done it. According to GB News, their sources say that Boris has reached the 100 MPs required to run in the leadership election. There's just one thing he's got to do, and that is announce that he is actually running. So come on, Boris, run. Now, yes, of course, there will be some people out there who will no doubt say that, no, Boris can't run because he got fined and all this over Partygate, but then again, so did Rishi. And not many people seem to be saying that, do they? Maybe they got some sort of short-term amnesia. I mean, who knows? Also, Rishi was in the same government, so if he thought that something something wasn't right, then he should have said something, shouldn't he? Now, what do I think that's going to happen? Because obviously Rishi hasn't announced that he's running yet either. It's just Penny Morden that's so far, apparently. But it will be interesting, won't it? Because Boris will more than likely win the votes off the membership. So, of course, it does actually make me wonder if Rishi will more than likely want to do some sort of deal with Boris so it doesn't look like he got wiped out too badly with the members of the party when they vote. Although, obviously, nothing is certain, is it? I mean, who knows? The members could vote against Boris. But from what I've heard, there are reports that quite a lot of them think that Rishi actually stabbed Boris in the back in the first place and therefore of course making him resign for the actions of another MP which I don't know about you but I thought was completely disgraceful anyway I mean yes okay Boris probably needed to tell enough about it but I didn't think he should have lost his job over it and Partygate aside I actually think Boris was quite a good Prime Minister so hopefully he'll be back sooner rather than later